When I was asked by Bemis maybe two, two and a half years ago now to think about a project, I decided that the project would be this series of town hall meetings. And the town hall meetings were meant to just find out what the pulse of Omaha was, and especially the kind of black pulse. What was happening in North Omaha is where we ended up. And um, in that, we found that artists said that they, they needed money, they needed space, and they, they needed a kind of mentorship. My project moved from this series of town hall meetings into actually trying to identify some space. The space that we found was at 24th and Lake, which had been historically a really important area. This, this part of the town have, have really had a rich heritage, particularly uh, uh, with the music. And I think part of the reason in inviting Big Mama in and then trying to grow a commercial core and thinking not only about the Carver building, but what else happens on the block, what happens on the four square blocks. And, um, and Big Mama just became a kind of an immediate, an immediate friend. Him and I kind of bonded very early. I find, you know, later on that I remind him of a relative or whatever, so that's even better. And then um, asking Big Mama if she'd be interested in joining us as we start this kind of reinvestment uh, in culture. Uh, the Astor and Hesse had proposed and asked me if I'd be interested in putting some type of a restaurant or a sandwich shop, you know, in the building. And I said yes. And that started the conversation um, for what is now, you know, her presence. Uh, in the Carver Bank project. North Omaha is very important. Second thing, artists are really important. It's an amazing testament to have uh, us all in these rooms, in this geography where we imagine that only bad things happen. For me, things are always, um, I always see the connection between things kind of on a spiritual level and the energy that I'm feeling it's real positive. And another thing that just is still blowing my mind is Big, Big Mama's my family. We're related. I didn't even, I did not know that. I think that this has been really, um, it, this is so phenomenal to me because I've been around here singing for years with my father. And, and to be recognized finally, you know, as, as a writer is just, uh, it's mind blowing. You know, I make sculptures out of trash and and I, I, I salvage a lot of materials in my paintings and sculptures. My art has been more like play. Like I try to make these universal things people recognize. I've been working on a series of globes of the world, of the planet, and I'll probably start with that. I can do anything from country. I can do uh, r and I just like to switch it up. All of us are so different, but we all click, and I love them. <laughs> to see so many happy, vibrant people that are ready to put North Omaha back on a course for the future. One more wow. Thank you. But my hope is that what happens is that the creation of space where artists from North Omaha can um, grow their practices is something that won't just be um, the ambition of the Bemis, it'll start to be um, the ambition of artists in North Omaha. And I hope that this will be a catalyst to encourage people to do other things here, that more people would invest, um, you know, in our community. Um, I, just, I just wanted to open up a a whole lot of opportunities for having a good sound community. And I think the more that we concentrate on that living, um, the, the better the chances are of its life being sustained. The Astor said, the thing that's important is finishing what you start. This place was a cloud of dust. No one thought it would look like this today, but there was an incredible team of people here to make it happen. And it's gonna be thrilling to see what happens over the next year and two years and three years. And it's the kind of partnerships that happen when those people over there hook up with these people over here 
and then you stop imagining yourselves as having spatial boundaries. When we can kind of think together for one cause to make really big ideas happen. And so I just want to say thanks to Bemis, the city of Omaha, and to our friends in North Omaha. You deserve it. Enjoy yourselves. Enjoy yourselves.